Well, we saw a very warm and breezy day for our Sunday, and we're going to be seeing above average temperatures pretty much all throughout the rest of next week. In the middle of next week, though, could have a couple of rain chances as of right now. They're a little bit on the slimmer side. We're going to keep an eye on that over the next couple of days. But the good news is we do have a possible cold front coming through just in time for the new year. But taking a look at our travel cast here, if you're heading out the door, heading home, heading somewhere for the holiday, you may want to take a look here. We're not going to be seeing too much going on over near Texas, so calmer conditions just around central Texas. But we could have a couple of rain chances coming through near the middle of next week, but especially near the end of next week. So as, we're, right, as of right now, looking to be a little bit on the slimmer side, so shouldn't be impacting your travel too much if you're heading out uh, to go somewhere else out of Texas. But for the most part, just want to be careful because those roads may be a little bit slicker near the end of next week. But taking a look at our future trek a little bit closer to home here, we are going to be seeing mostly partly cloudy conditions at the beginning of our Monday. Could see a shower or two as well, mostly east of I-35 near the Brazos Valley area. But for the most part, that's really just going to be a drizzle. But as we head further into our Monday, going to be seeing much clearer skies, so in partly cloudy conditions heading into Tuesday as well. And we do have some rain chances in place for our Wednesday. But let's take a look at our wind speeds because we saw a very breezy day for our Sunday. And we're going to be seeing that continuing into our Monday as well. About 15 to 20 mile per hour winds heading into Monday as well as into Tuesday. So definitely going to be on the gustier side for the next couple of days here, which will be kind of nice since we are going to be seeing temperatures on the warmer side. But taking a look at later on tonight, we're going to be cooling down to the mid to lower 60s heading into tomorrow morning. And then we're going to be warming right back up to the mid to upper 70s. So another warm afternoon and we're going to be seeing warm temperatures temperatures pretty much all throughout this week. Mid to upper 70s is what we're going to be seeing for the next couple of days here. We're going to see partly cloudy conditions as well, and we'll be seeing a couple of rain chances coming through near the middle of next week, but our biggest rain chances, that's going to be ahead of the cold front coming through, which will be cooling us down to the mid to upper 50s. So cooler temperatures are on the way. You must just have to wait until 2022.